Shanice, anything you want to say? I didn't murder anybody. Shanice Aviles did not take a life, but police say she has been taking anything she could get her hands on. In fact, police call her a serial burglar. This time, she allegedly broke into actor Robert De Niro's Upper East Side townhouse. Did he go to Robert De Niro's house? Did he go to Robert De Niro's house? It's something Aviles outright denied, as she was being transported from the 19th precinct charged with burglary. Police say early Monday morning, officers saw Aviles trying to open doors on East 65th Street on the Upper East Side. Officers followed her. At one point, they noticed a door at a townhouse ajar. They waited to see what was going on. After a few minutes, when they did not see Aviles come out, the officers went in. Sources say they found the 30-year-old on the second floor of the home, trying to use the actor's iPad and bagging up gifts De Niro and his family had under their Christmas tree. I was just surprised that somebody could get into a house up here. People who live in the area are very concerned about what happened. There are several security cameras at the townhouse, but that did not deter a thief. Safety is always a bit of a concern, but I'm actually still very optimistic about the city. Police say Aviles got in through the basement. By Monday afternoon, all of the locks were being changed at the townhouse where De Niro was staying with his family. Aviles is no stranger to police. They say she has been busy at work breaking into homes and businesses at least seven times between November 25th and December 8th on the Upper East Side. She has 26 prior arrests, 16 for burglaries. The NYPD describes Aviles as one of the 19th Precinct's top five most wanted burglars. It's kind of interesting to hear that a, a townhouse was broken into. I mean, this is a pretty wealthy area around here. And neighbors say it's also a safe area. The actor and his family, they were not hurt, and they do have their gifts. As we speak, Aviles is expected to face a judge. De Niro is not commenting at this time. For now.